Hey everyone and welcome. Today we're going to be looking at character level styling in the text plus title box. Um, in a regular text box you can style your characters however you want just in the editor box. But in the text plus box that you have to go into a, a second level deeper let's say to be able to do it. But it is capable and it's not that hard to do. So let's get to it. All right let's jump into this. I would eventually started with a new project open and what we want to do is add a text plus title. So we'll make sure our effects are turned on. Again, if it's not up here, the toggle on and off. So I'll come down here to titles and I'll bring in a text plus box. And we'll go up here and we'll just change our text to say, oh, let's go with line one. And then we'll skip a line and go line two, and then we'll do line three. That's good. Now, if I come in here and change my color, it affects everything. As you see, go back to white for that. So even if I come up here like you would in the text box and try to change the color, it's still affects everything. So to be able to change just a single line or a single character, jump over into the fusion page and look into your text box editor, right click and do character level styling. Turn this on. Also notice that your keyframe turned color instead of being white. You also notice that up at the top here, modifiers button is now available. It was there before, but it was grayed out. Using this modifiers tab is how you change this styling for each line. So we come over here, make sure you're in the fusion page and make sure you're on modifiers. This modifiers button is not available except on the Fusion page. So you click on modifiers and you see nothing. The reason that is, is there is nothing selected to, to change. So I come over here and I select my first line or even just part of my first line, but I'll just collect the whole thing. You see how it's outlined in green. So those are the characters you're going to affect. Now I can come over here and change colors and it only affects what I have selected. Change my font, change my size. I can come over here if I want to affect this line. I just selected them both. And now if I just want to select that line, change his color to whatever. Now you have character level styling. Line three. We have yellow just for fun. Give him a funny font. But that's how in a text plus box. You can change each line, each letter, and everything like that. Pretty simple. You just have to know how to get to it. And in a standard text box, you can do all of this just in the regular text box. But that's part of the differences between the text and the text plus box. Anyway, I hope you found this informative and helpful. Everyone have a good day. Bye. Thank you.